Hey everyone and welcome to the official installation and instruction video of the Now Capital Freebot. I'm super excited to release this to the public and I'm hoping it helps a lot of you. So let me show you exactly how this is going to run and how to set it up. So once we start over here on this download page after you've watched the video, you can see I've given you a breakdown of the pairs and their graphs. You just click this download here button, simple, easy. It's going to give you a little file like this, a little zip file. And then once you've extracted that, it's going to leave you with a folder. And inside that folder, you have this little .ex5 file. That's pretty much it. So how you install this, first thing, you're going to open up MetaTrader. And as you can see here on the side, I have expert advisors, advisors, and I've made folders and I've put the bot in that folder. So I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. Now, once MetaTrader is open, you're going to go to the left, you're going to click on file and you're going to click on open data folder. Once you've done this, it's going to present you with this uh, seemingly confusing little pop up, but that's OK. You're going to click on MQL5, go to experts and then advisors. Now, in this advisor folder here. You can either just simply drag this or paste. You can't really drag it. So you have got to right click and say paste and you got to paste it in there. Or you can make a new folder like I've done here. I've called it now capital free robot, but you can rename it. You can literally call it now capital bot. And then you can copy the folder just like this and paste it in here. Now you'll see it shows up as two files. Don't worry, just simply click refresh. Right click refresh. Now you're going to see it shows here as now capital free robot.ea. But it does not yet show here on the left hand side in MetaTrader. So once you've copied that over and you've closed that down, you can close this. You can simply right click anywhere here and just say refresh. You're going to see this folder now shows up as now capital free robot.ea. And inside that folder, you have this little thing with a blue hat. Now, this bot is designed to work on DEX 900 on the five minute time frame, DEX 600 down, also DEX 900 down, but DEX 600 down on the five minute time frame, and then crash 300 on the one minute time frame. Now, written into the code of this bot, it is locked. So you can't change anything. You don't need to change anything. And even if your time frame of your overall chart here on MetaTrader is on one hour and it is a five minute bot, it should only take its trades according to what is going on on the five minutes. However, I do recommend that once you place it on a chart with like where it requires a five minute or one hour time frame, that you switch the chart to that time frame and you leave it there to run. Right. So, for example, right here now we are on the DEX 600 down pair on its five minute chart. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply drag this bot onto this chart. And you're going to have a little pop up like this. There's not anything really you need to change or do. All you need to do is allow these two boxes down here. So it's going to say allow modification of signal settings. You check that. And then you say allow algo trading. You check that. And you click OK. Now you're almost done. If you can see here on the top right side, it's going to say now capital free bot. And there's a little hat here, right? Right here. And that's that hat is grayed out. So now what you need to do is you need to come up to this little box up here that says algo trading with a red square. And you click that. You just click it. So it shows a little green triangle. And now you'll also see that this bot here or this name here has a blue hat. When this hat is blue, it means the bot is actively running and you can leave your computer and the bot will place trades. If the hat is gray like this, it means it's not active. It is attached to the chart, but it's not active. Now, on the left hand side here, you also see something that's a little piece of text that says this bot is currently running on the correct time frame for DEX 600 down. If you were to change this time frame to one hour, it will tell you. The now capital bot is designed to run on a five minute chart only for DEX 600 down index. Please apply it to a five minute chart. So it's going to ask you to just put it back on that five minute chart, leave it there, make sure that the bot runs. Now, if you were to place this bot on 
a pair, for example, that it's not made to work on, right? Let's say, for example, we go to VIX75 and we drag this bot onto here. You can still allow it to do anything. Click OK. It's going to give you a little pop-up that just says the bot is designed for DEX 900 down, DEX 600 down, and Crash 300. It will not run on Volatility or VIX 75. So that is literally how simple we've made this bot for you. You can't change anything. You don't need to change anything. Just put it on the pair that it's made for on the correct time frame, and that's it. Now, if you're also wondering about running it on all three pairs simultaneously, you can do that. We have DEX 600 open. I'm going to open up DEX 900 down. Just give it some nice colors. And I'll do the same with Crash 300. Give it some nice colors as well. So now you can see these pairs, if you look at the top right hand, they have no, they have no bots attached to them, right? So DEX 500 down, or DEX 600 down five minutes. It's got the bot attached. I'm going to enable algorithmic trading. I'm going to go to DEX 900, change it over to the five minutes because that's its time frame. And I'm also just going to drag the bot on, allow both settings. Okay. The bot, because it's blue, has been enabled. And the same on Crash 300. I'm simply going to drag the bot on, allow both, click OK. And now the bot is running on all three pairs simultaneously. There's no need to change anything, no need to add magic numbers. It's already written in. The bot automatically generates and locks in its own numbers. So that's really how simple it is. I hope this bot helps. The graphs looks good. The back test looks good. And we've made some good money from it in our testing. So I hope this helps you guys. And please obviously send us an email or send us a message in the Discord if you have any other questions or recommendations of what we can do to the spot. But that is it. Literally, drag, drop, enable, done. If you need help on a VPS, simply Google how to use MetaTrader's integrated VPS on YouTube. And I'm sure one of those tutorials will help you. Peace.